I want to put that game behind us. Our next segment is a new one, folks. Let us know how you feel about this in the comments. It's our own version of Mary Cuddle Kill. We're going with starter, backup, and bench to describe what we like most moderately and not at all. Mm. So I'm going to present you with a situation and three options, and you tell me, Peach, what's your starter, what's your backup, and what's your bench? The first one, imagine you are Jamal Mosley. Mm -hmm. And you're having a Mosley moment here. You get the injury report and it has like it has had for a couple games, both Cole Anthony and Gary Harris on the injury report with our current roster. Who do you start in the second guard position next to Suggs Hampton hmm. Ross or Michael Mulder? Hmm. Um, yeah, this is a pretty true to life thing that just happened. Um, I, I I'm going to start Hampton. I'm leaving Ross as the backup and I'm going bench on Mulder. I feel like this kind of speaks for itself. I want to see Hampton just get a shot at starter. And this seemed like a good opportunity when you have two key guards out. Um, Ross is more comfortable being the backup. So let him stay there. And I, I guess maybe they did this to get Mulder some more minutes and see what he can bring to the table. But I feel like this guy is meant to be a bench and a reserve. And that's really where he needs to be. It's no offense to him. I just feel like I know what he is and I don't know what Hampton is. So I want him to get the minutes and see what he can do. I think I agree with you there. I think I would do the same starter Hampton Ross would be my backup and Mulder to the bench in that order. And I, this is what Magic Twitter Sphere was kind of talking about, that why aren't we starting Hampton? This is the perfect opportunity to get him some minutes. Everyone has been screaming for some more minutes just to see what we have because he's one of the guys we got to figure out here. And when we have an opportunity, we don't put him in. Some of the theories about why we were doing this is saying, well, you know, the old the old Steve Clifford mentality, he liked to keep guys in their role. So if someone got injured, they, he would plug that injured spot and, and keep the, the roles intact. So, you know, even if one of our guards got injured last year, he wouldn't put T Ross into the starting lineup. He would keep him as our sixth man coming off the bench as a scorer. Sure. And I get that. But then I, my next query to you would be, so you, we already just see RJ Hampton as a bench guy. We've already decided that then. If Mosley is trying to continue to have his role off the bench, that's just what he's going to be. And I mean, I, I understand that. I kind of feel like that's maybe where he'll end up, but the guy right. is so young right. that don't you want to get him in there and see. And also he seems like when, when we have, we got a lot of young guys, he seems like he has a psyche that needs to be encouraged. And mm -hmm. so I feel like rewarding him with that minutes would have been a great confidence boost for a young guy who might need it. Yes, I think that is a great point to go out on in this one.